All right, let's go. I think we're live. I think we're live. We should be. All right, we're at Bachman Lake. I wonder if you guys can hear me. You should be able to hear me. I got the wireless mic in. Hemp on a blimp. Let's see if we got everything locked. All right. Why am I here right now? I guess I can take off this. Here. Where's the other? Maybe it's in the car. Okay, it doesn't matter. All right. Guys, we're here at Bachman Lake, trying to get some freaking exercise. Usually I got the weighted vest, but I want to be able to talk and, you know, kind of makes it hard to talk. So we're going to do one lap, hemp on a blimp lap, got the mic, because we got to do some more promotion. We got a comedy show tonight in Plano, 7 p.m., probably started like 7.15, and it's going to be insane for the Ukraine, like we always say. Uh, we need a lot of people out there. So let me check the other apps. Now that I got away from the car to see how the services, see if we're live. Let's see. Okay, Bonoblim checking. Looks like we are. Okay, good. I can see me. I see the chat. Yo, what up? What up? What up? How's the audio? Checking. Oh, the audio is good. The audio is good. What's up, Nick? Oh, let's see. What's up, Pre? No, I'm live right now, though. I'm live on YouTube walking around Bachman. What's up? Oh, did you did you return it? The belt? What about the glasses? Oh, well, I don't think I gave you the right code for the glasses. doesn't matter. The glasses, were, uh, they just came late. Um, okay, well, I'm grinding. What are you going to get to eat? Is that kind of crazy doing this phone call and then... How do I get to the call? It's so hard. Okay. Our speaker. Hi. I'm live right now. Okay. So where are you thinking about eating? They can hear you. They should be able to hear you now. Free. Yeah. What are you thinking about getting? I was thinking about maybe getting Subway, but I don't know. Subway? What? We never get Subway. I know, but I was thinking about no, okay, I can go. Takes me somewhere better than Subway. Come on, eat fresh. I'm sorry. I'd rather have Jim Johns than Subway. Yeah, it's true. I don't think I'm going to go for Subway. Go to Subway and give me a dish of all right, peace. All right, I haven't had churro from there yet. I won't buy it. I need bread. I guess it's something's wrong with the internet, the service. It just kicks me out. Looks like we're still live, though. But yeah, it just freaking kicks me out. I'm trying to log in on my other phone. But we can go live right now if you guys can hear me. What the heck? I keep saying try again. Let me delete this. Delete it. 
Guys, we're trying to plug a comedy show tonight. We're having all these technical difficulties. It's actually kind of fun that it go live like this. See what kind of trouble we can get into. See the sun right there? Always. Can you believe Ryan Garcia won that fight? That's what I can't believe. That's what we got to talk about. He's just freaking dominated. I don't know how the audio is. But it keeps kicking me out on this one. I just have to do this one. Okay, hold on. Let's see. Okay. Crap. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Crap. Okay. I think we're live. Let's see. We should be live. Let's see. We had. And now I wonder if you guys can hear me or not. So I locked the screen. Okay, yeah, you should be able to hear me. Let me check the chat. Hello. Let me check the chat. People always look at me weird when I'm looking at my phone. Let's see. Now it's like giving me access. Let me go to YouTube. See, this is the phone I should have been using the whole time. I think this has a better camera anyway. Uh, let's see if we're still live. Okay, we still are. Almost 100 of you are over 100 people are watching. Okay, good. Can you hear me? Let me see some yes in the chat. Sounds good. Okay, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Now we can get back on the vibes. Looks like I'm getting audio levels. All right, tonight in Plano, Texas, 7 p.m. We got freaking primetime 99. Got a nice little warm up for Austin. Chat rap meetup. It's going to be insane. It's going to be insane. And then we're at Bachman Lake right now. Anything can happen on a Sunday at the lake. Anything. There can be pleasure. There can be pain. There can be, I don't even want to say a lot of the terms because I don't want to be subject to some sort of terms of service violation for just describing some of the debauchery. Well, not neglecting some of the positive things that happen at this lake. But uh, this is also the scene where a lot of controversy over Turtle Gate. We're going to go discuss that. We're going to walk right by that. So you guys are going to be able to see how they are basically abusing turtles. Not letting them out of the damned area because it's all fenced in. I mean, look at this. It's beautiful. Nature's beauty. Did you see on the internet, though? My biological stepdad, Tucker Carlson, he said on Joe Rogan that he believes that evolution is bullcrap, which I agree with him. And Joe, like, gave him some kickback. And uh, he's getting, uh, you know, atheist Twitter is going crazy on him. And I was actually surprised there was a lot of conservatives, too. Like Jeremy Boring. You see that coming out? Saying that. It's anti-America to think 9-11 was done by George Bush, even though just the official story is that George Bush did have a briefing and just chose, you know, to not take the threat serious enough. So he was warned about it. Even according to him, he had prior knowledge technically. I mean, he had an idea that it was possible. So, you know, it is what it is. People look at me like I'm crazy. Hopefully on the other side of the lake, maybe we can interact with some people. I just started, like I said, usually I got the vest, but no vest so we can talk, walk. We might be might do more of these and then just put them behind the paywall for the new Blaze subscribers. We're almost at 100. We're gonna do a show tomorrow. We're so close. I don't even wanna say the number we're so close. We're basically there, but we do need a few more subs. Um, so if you guys want to sign up, prime time, blazetv.com slash prime time, use the promo code prime time 99. Let's go. And then tonight, if you're in the Dallas area, come see the pimp on a blast. We need you. 
if you're in the Metroplex, message me on Instagram. Do, do not message me on TikTok. I don't use my TikTok. They're about to ban it. They do. You know, everything's getting weird out there. Chinese people are spying on our information while Americans are doing it too. <laughs> it's all a joke. Also, if you want to hear some more jokes, go to tinyurl.com slash 99 in Plano. Get some tickets. All right, we're live. I can't, it doesn't tell me if I got any super chats or anything, so I don't know. I guess I can look. Oh, we almost have 200 people. Oh, wow. Uh, people are hating in the chat. There are some people getting timed out in the chat already. What the hell? The steak eaters mad. I'm I need attention. I'm trying to create some content. I'm trying to freaking promote this show. Steak eater, don't hate on a player. That's the thing. All these people want to hate on a player. Go do you, pimp. In my chat, mad at me. That's the deals. We need some more content, pimp. I'm out here grinding. I'm about to step up the grind. Y'all are hating on me. On a fake account. Y'all need to check yourself before you wreck yourself, pimp. I mean, and I'm out and about, dog. I'm on the grind. You hating because I'm out here trying to just go live because I live it live? You can't pimp like this. You can't grind like this because if you put on a camera right now, it'd be disgusting. It looked like a prison cell. Bitch, I'm free. I'm at the lake, dog. I ain't worried about no earthquake. God, some of the, that negative vibrational energy y'all got. Y'all got to direct that to another player. You know? Y'all got a PhD, a play hating degree. Y'all know it. You know it. Come on. Y'all trying to get my vibes wrong. Vibe check. All right, well, now, oh crap, I didn't even start the the uh, thing. Oh, we've already done like almost half a mile. Well, maybe we'll walk a little past it. And I gotta go get some more cat food. So maybe I'll take you guys with me to go get some cat food once we've walked around the lake. I'm surprised there aren't more planes coming. Maybe there's less flights coming this direction. Because sometimes they land coming the other way, obviously, due to wind. But this is a great place to watch the planes, the Boeing. I'm always trying to inspect them to see if there's any damage that I can just inspect because you can't see it all when you're at the terminal. But when you're under here and the planes are flying over, you have a better inspection point. Yo, we're live right now. You want to be, a, we're on TV. Say what's up. What's up, man? Pimp on a blimp. We got a live comedy show. What, what's going? What are you guys doing out here? Uh, right? man, just we're, we're, we're walking off the food. <laughs> Me too. We got to freaking exercise. <laughs> we got to freaking exercise. This guy you saw first here on Arcado TV. Yes. These guys, see, it's nice. Everybody's cool vibes out here at the lake. Um, let me see what the YouTube's saying. See what's going on. All right. Yes, congratulations to Chrissy Mayer, her baby Frank, Frank Jr. We all need to shout that out. It looks like the footage is a little choppy. Dang. Why does it do that? You think these cell phones, like, I guess I got to get like an undefeated hotspot. There's other streamers. It doesn't, doesn't happen to them as much, I feel like. They got some sort of special hotspot. They got to. That's the only way, I feel like. Okay. Oh, we got some people on the Alex Stein channel too. What's up to everybody there? I love you guys. What's up, chat rats? Lila Hart's there. We love Lila. It's Lila's opening tonight. So if y'all in the DFW area, you're going to get to hang out with me and Jimmy, which I know is not. Something you're looking forward to necessarily, but still, you get to do it. You get to yell at him. And I'll let you guys throw stuff at him while he's on stage. The club probably doesn't want you to do that. So, it needs to be soft. Oh, okay, guys, we got over 200. I love it. 
I love it. We're out here hustling, putting in the time. Got to get rid of that double chin, my weight. I've just been, ever since that boxing match, and then since Hank passed away, I've just been eating. It's not Hank's fault. I'm just saying I've been emotionally stressed, eating the pain away. I got to get back on my fitness journey. All right? And tonight, I got to exercise my lungs. You're going to get every emotion tonight. You're going to get an inside look at who I am. Primetime Alex Stein, my story as a youth growing up, being targeted by the cartel as a son of a bell bondsman, running for my life. I'm going to tell you these stories tonight. Not in an educational way, in a comedic way, where you can learn from some of my triumphs and some of my tribulations. Yeah. This is a tribulational show. Is that a word? Tribulational? It's tribulations. By primetime Alex Stein. That's what it is. That's what the hell this is. Deep die, staying alive. That's what this is. Grinding. As soon as I started walking, I feel like I have to use a restroom, but I think I'll be okay. Tribulational. Vibrational. How you feeling on my Haitians? Welcome to Dallas. You're going to get a free palace, a free apartment. I'm going to pay the rent. And you're going to get a Visa or a MasterCard with 10K on it. EBT, food only. Uh, man, I should run for Congress soon. I know. But really and truly, everybody in D.C., did you see those politicians just celebrating and waving Ukraine flags. I mean, as if we don't have issues at our border, they want to send 60 billion. Why not vote to spend 60 billion on our own border? I don't understand it. Well, I do understand it because it's all fake. They want our border to be flooded. So, oh, I guess it's not a mistake, you poo. There's a plane that I'm talking about. I don't know how the audio is, but that's the plane. We're on the grind. People are having parties over here. You can swing this. See? We're out here. Let's see. Let's go see the. Let's see if I can go. Let's go talk to the park ranger. Hey, so my name is Alex. I'm a, I got a host. I host a show on Blaze TV and I've put, been posting videos. You know where they dammed it up? Have you noticed all the dead turtles that have been stuck where they've dammed it? Have you done anything about that? Uh, that's not something we would do at uh, animal services. Um, or other, other departments, if that's their area, we don't do that anything with that. Our brain just don't deal with Yeah, that. but who do I contact? Because I send an email to Jesse Moreno. I also send an email to Omar Navarez. I can, I can, I can run that information by... Uh, Please, so because like because yeah. I have the footage, and, and there's turtles that have been smashed and, and killed. It's right where they fence it off. You know, it's a damn spillway, so those turtles can't get... They can't get so back. So let me ask you this. Is it uh, before the rec center? Is it... Fire. It's right past the rec center. It's, it's, it's right past the rec center. You know, that fire. little okay. pond. Okay. Please have somebody look at it because there's Absolutely. been so many turtles. And I've sent emails, but just, and there's so many turtles that, that they can't go anywhere. And, and turtles part of our cultural Turtle Creek. Absolutely. Absolutely. Please say something about the turtles. I'm going to buy some. Thank, Thank you. you. We got to save these turtles, guys. We got to save them. Um, we love the park here, though. A lot of people around. He was nice. He seemed like he cared a little bit, but he's also like, it's not my, 
It's not my job. Well, we'll race him out. We talked to the park ranger. We got this clip. We can, we can clip this. And then we can send this to the city. At least it shows we're talking to the park rangers. We're, you know, putting in the effort. We're, we're channeling our energy on something positive that can help these animals out. You know? It's pretty gangster here. Everybody's just kind of odors of marijuana, maybe CBD. I don't know. It smells all kind of crazy out here. You know, but that's the vibe in the park. People just drinking, partying. You guys know how we do it here in Dallas. We don't play around. Look at the turtles in the chat. We need turtles in the chat. What's up, chat? We need turtles. Look at that. Why is the quality not that great when I'm talking to the, the parks and rec guy? Well, we need to clip that. We got to send that to the city so they know that I'm out here actually talking the talk. See, look, turtles right there. There's some turtles right there. I don't know if you guys can see. Let's see if I can switch it. Well, you guys see the turtles right there? Lots of turtles here, guys. It's a heavy turtle area. Lots of turtles. So that's why they're getting stuck over there. We need a game plan to be able to save them. Should be a simple solution. We need like some sort of animal sanctuary, an animal conservatory, I don't know. Some turtle charity. And save the turtles. All right. Turtle nets? No, we don't want turtle nets. I know you're joking with that. I don't know if that, I mean, those nets can't be good, right? Those nets can't be good. Those nets can't be good in the hood. All right, well, like I said, we're over here in the Northwest, area, Northwest Highway area. Can't even speak because I'm a little out of breath already. We've done over a mile. But I only started it like half a mile in. So, you know, who knows where this journey will take us today. We're on the search. We're on the grind. We've talked to the park ranger. I can show you guys evidence of unsafe habitat conditions created by the Dallas Parks and Rec Department. I mean, I'm a graduate of the Citizens Police Academy, so... Investigations like this are nothing to somebody like me. Um, open and shut case from the start. They didn't decide to put in the proper protocols or procedures to save these turtles. So they will have to pay. Um, they will have to farm more turtles, save more turtles in the future, be more cognizant of the turtles. There's a plan. I don't know if you guys can see it, but... You gotta get the turtle turtle stuff back in order. Not just a you know turtle tor torment. Turtle torture. No, that's no good. That's what they're doing out here. We gotta help them. Whew, the weather's nice so it's not too hot. I got the Bill Belichick, got the Bill Belichick, got the Bill Belichick hoodie, but no sleep. <laughs> Let's go, Patriots, deflate gay. Deflate gate up in the who ready to deflate gate. All right. That's Southwest Airlines headquarters. No joke. No joke. The headquarters in Dallas, right here at Love Field. So Pimp, you know I get them discount flights. Ah, you know I'd be saving money getting two carry-on bags for free. Look at the plan. Yeah, look at the plan. Oh. Did that look good? Well, all right. Uh. We're huffing and puffing. There's a thrift store over here we might want to go to. We can get some funny content at the thrift store.
Wow. I'm starting to burn some cows. You know what I mean? Feel it in my stomach. Ah! Ah! All right. Oof. Now we're cooking with gas. This on the other side of the dam, that's where the turtles are being locked in by the chain link fences. And no justice, no peace for these turtles. All right, 275. Now we're cooking. Now we're cooking, chat. Oh, $20 super chat. Bad Buddhist. Yes. Thank you, Bad Buddhist. $20 super chat. Yeah. We do need to save the turtles. Got to save the turtles. All right. Let's see. Let's see if we can walk by. We'll go by this thrift store. Let's see if we can. We only have so much time. You know, tonight we have a comedy show. You know that, right? So we just gotta gotta grind this lap out. Try to get a little bit of content for you guys. So it's not too too boring. I want to be able to connect, talk to y'all. This is St. Vincent de Paul thrift store. Let's see. They might freak out if I go in there. But we'll just tell them we're making a TikTok. We're on TikTok a lot. Oh my gosh. You can see it's a huge thrift store. See? Look at that. It's humongous. Looks like there's a lot of like kind of broken stuff out here. A little bit. Like this desk. Looks like it's broken. That's the broken section. I think. <sighs> St. Vincent de Paul. You can see what's going on in the thrift. <sighs> it's kind of bumping in here. Where's the men's? Look at these good crutches. I might need to buy those crutches. Because then I can walk into like a meeting and I could fall down. So, I don't know. I mean, I just don't know what we should buy. I don't want to waste any money. But, you know, that's definitely going to get us a copyright. But we'll probably put this behind the paywall anyway. Oh, look at these hats. Costa Vida. Should I get this one? This is my hat. I wear this. This is already a big. This is already a big hat. The one I got. I love the size of this hat. I don't really. It's all like women's clothes. I feel like there's not a lot of men's. This is all women. I don't know what the men's are. Women's? Women's? Where, where's the men's? Where's the men's stuff? Men's. Men's is what I Oh. I can't, find, I can't find it. I hear it kind of is.
I mean, the men's, it's all women's stuff in here, too. Nothing good. No, it's not really anything good in here. It's packed, though. There's a lot of people. I feel like the service is bad. Is it cutting in and out for y'all? I get I guess my service is bad. Let's... I don't know why it doesn't work in here. It's just it's I don't know why. A Cinco de Mayo. Oh, that's why there's so many Cinco de Mayo. Oh, excuse me. That's why there's so much Cinco de Mayo stuff. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> there wasn't anything really good in there, to say the least. I think we lost viewers. Somehow we lost viewers in there. <laughs> Are we even still live anymore? I don't even know. Okay, yes. I guess it's because in there we're losing viewers because the service is bad. What the heck? Make sure to hit that like button. Every day, Cinco de Mayo. Cinco de Mayo is a big deal here, pal. All right. All right. Let's go. We're grinding. Looks like we're live again. The service is kind of crap, but uh, we'll have to make do. We'll have to make do. We started 31 minutes ago. It says one mile. We really have a little more than that. Remember, we started late. All right. Happy Sunday. Oh, 30% off everything. That's why things are so crazy in there. And 50% off all furniture. <laughs> That's, I don't know if you guys can't hear that. That's what they're saying. All right. Well, let's get back in fitness mode. We got to finish these uh, last few miles. We need to get some of y'all to in the DFW area to come out on out to the show tonight. <laughs> So we can have fun. We can talk about some dangerous conspiracy theories. <laughs> it's so funny how that's like a real thing. Even after the pandemic, people are still trying to deny the fact that conspiracies exist. It's crazy. But, uh, all right. That's... Yeah, that's you're right. I don't even want to tell somebody how to live their life, really. I don't think that that's like my problem. But I guess the fact that he is Jeremy Boring, oh, he is so you know against that. It's going to limit <laughs> my possibility of even being a guest on their network, probably. But whatever. We got to say the things people are afraid to talk about. And actually look into, I mean, I'm a wild person, but a lot of the wild things I say have some credence, believe it or not. Uh, you know, we can't be cookie cutter. Can't be the same. We got to be different, unique. Got to be an enigma too sometimes. Oh, look, they got like horchata and stuff over there with that blue tint. I don't have any cash on me. I don't have any cash on me. Well, maybe I'll drive around after. We got to get my mind right. Some of the topics we're going to discuss tonight. Obviously, the gambit of conspiracies. Obviously, we're going to talk about my life. Talk about 
what it takes to be a pimp, how to achieve pimp status. You know how it's going to be, dog. <clears throat> and it's going to be a crowd of people that love the pimp. So come on out, Plano, Texas. That's where I always, that's where I originally went insane for the Ukraine. Uh, Plano City Council. And I'm going to be speaking there a bunch more. But uh, if you're in the DFW area and you're like thinking about coming, tonight is a good night. We got a freaking, it's the first time I've headlined at this club, House of Comedy. It's a Sunday night. So every, every seat matters. It's going to be PM. It is going to be fun. Because it's going to be really laid back. You're going to get prime time 99, 110%. Shot out of a cannon, relaxed, high key again, relaxed. I mean, if you really want to get the live experience, feel the sweat, the blood, the tears. Tonight's a night, pimp, but if not, we're going to be in Austin on the 26th, Friday. And that following night, the 27th, I'll be at the Mines event. So a lot of opportunities in Texas. To come hang. Let's freaking take a picture. Link up. That's what we need to do. I want to be a man of the people. I want to be, you know, a chat rat for all. You know what I mean? Together. So, yeah, the thrift store wasn't that bumping. 30% off. People in there were going crazy. Fighting for... Dockers and khakis. And then, I don't know. There's a lot of women's clothes in that and clothes. That was like all women's clothes. Sometimes other thrift stores, they seem like they have a lot of guy stuff. I mean, usually, obviously, more women's clothes. But I'm saying that one seemed like there was like very little men's stuff. I don't know. It was just like in the corner. That thrift store is not that great. There's better ones that have better junk. Thrift stores are fun, though, because you can buy stuff there that you can't get at a normal store. I mean, I guess you could say you can get it at eBay. But I follow some of those accounts of people that just go to thrift stores and, like, resell the stuff. I don't think they make a ton of money, but it is funny what they find that has value at a thrift store. I mean, like, of course they find, like, old video game stuff. It's sometimes worth a lot, sometimes not. But just all kinds of weird stuff. Glass, china, like whatever weird trinkets. It's funny. It's like American Road Show. You know, you buy something for five dollars and end up being worth, you know, fifty, a hundred, a thousand, whatever. That's always fun. People are honking. They see the pimp. They see the pimp shining. They see the pimp grinding. So we're right next to the highway right next to the road so you guys can see my right hand can get a little bit of freaking rest but we're live right now out here at Bachman Lake trying to make a dollar out of 15 cent you heard that you heard that Let's see maybe I'll show this angle it's a little more intense so yeah I'm still blown away by what happened in DC this weekend for a weekend vote like they hate having to vote during the weekend and it's just Mike Johnson I mean I know talking politics is so stupid because it's all so dumb but I mean the fact that the FBI can just, you know, I mean, with the Patriot Act, we gave them access for warrantless search and seizure of basically anything when it comes to, you know, domestic or regular terrorism, whatever they want to call it. So it's just sad, all of the weaponization of our, you know, police forces to arrest all these people for January 6th. Yet, like, we're, nobody's really 
they want to make you afraid that a terrorist attack is always going to happen, but it's just, it's just highly unlikely. <laughs> but bad things do happen. But, I mean, the Constitution is just gone. They don't want that to exist. It's pretty lame. But it's a beautiful day, so what does that make you think? We got to be, you know, grateful. We got to have gratitude for a few things. Like, I'm... Uh, I got gratitude for this sun. I got gratitude for all the chat rats. You know, even though the world is crashing down, I get to come and hang out with you freaks online. Why not? How does it get better than that? It don't, pimp. <laughs> we have these weird parasocial relationships between the content creator and the audience. But, uh, you know, it's, it's a copacetic relationship. I don't exist without y'all, so I am grateful for y'all, even when things are going bad in the world. And that's probably why, like, guys like Jeremy Boring, you know, that's super rich, he doesn't want, you know, the world to be alive because his reality is good. He's probably, you know, he's not fully self-actualized, but he's reached the level of self-actualization that he probably is, like, satisfied with. So, you know, you want to bring your family up into, you know, a utopia, not, you know, a corrupt system run by, uh, you know, one world order, deep state. That's not the kind of world you want to raise your kids in. So it's like ignorance is bliss. And that's true. It's like if you don't know something, then it doesn't even affect you. I mean, there, there really is something to that. I guess on a, <coughs> a unicycle. <coughs> Damn, I'm getting some dust. Oh. Damn, it's stinky and dusty. What's going on over here? That's the bus depot. Because we're on the grind. This is where the turtles, this is where the turtles have been dying. Because of Mayor Johnson right here. They get stuck and they've been, this is with a chain. So they go out there, they think there's water over there, there's not. So this is where, this is where it's been happening. Right here. You see this fence. And we'll try to walk down there, I'll kind of show you. What's wrong with all the turtles? It's very sad. Uh, so, this is the high ground. There's probably some turtle that's already dehydrated and died even trying to climb up here. And then, you know, the landscapers have just been letting it grow, which I guess is good. I don't know. I don't know if that helps the turtle's habitat, probably. But, uh, see... You have like people down here and then uh, it's like you can only <sighs> you see see how the water's low they've dammed it What's the chat saying? All right. So this is this, this is where it is. Looks like they've let in a little more water. Oh, it's because it rained all day yesterday. That's only why. But you guys see that fence? They can't. The turtles are stuck. They can't get around that fence or under that fence. But it's nice. It's, it, it rained all yesterday, which is good that it did that because now there's a little bit of water in here. But it's usually like really low. Thank goodness some rain happened. But still, it's they're sitting ducks. It's gonna be hot for the next couple of days and this water's just gonna go away in like two seconds. But 
This is it. And this is the water is hot. This is probably the highest the water has been in months because we got the most rain we've had in months. Uh, it's just sad. Usually it's so low you can like see the turtle. Like there's one turtle right there. He was just breaching. You probably couldn't see it because it doesn't let me zoom, but there was just a turtle. We can love the turtles out here. We love the turrets and McGirts. Uh, so you guys see that fence, we can't go over. They're just stuck back here. The cranes are just, just like sitting ducks. All right, we're huffing and puffing. I probably should have worn the vest because this, uh, this workout's been a little too easy. I thought like, oh, well, I'll be talking the whole time. When I'm wearing that on my chest, it makes it a little harder to do that. But if I'm gonna do these, I probably need to start wearing that. Well, I don't know what the chat's saying. Oh, look, we got a super chat, $2. Dude, you unmodded me, sup with that. I don't know on Common News, we had to unmod everybody. We had a mod attack. We had a rogue mod. No joke, we really did. And they like timed out everybody and did all this crazy stuff. So we had to unmod a bunch of people. So I'm sorry about that on Common News. The mods ruined it. Jealousy and envy ruins everything. All right. Um, yeah, I mean, you got the top chat rat, Morgan Elizabeth. She's the top mod. She's all we need. I mean, thank you for the other ones. But Morgan's tough. She's ferocious. She's the top chat rat soldier, no doubt about that. Zero doubt about that. We're going to have a great time in Austin. Morgan's going to be there. All the other loyal chat rats. We're going to be partying on 6th Street. Partying on 6th Street. Ah! You know, I'm going to be going crazy. I'm going to be swinging off the top of the rafters. I'm going to be playing Lil John. I'm going to be doing a bunch of stuff. Okay? We're going to be doing a bunch of stuff. All right, now we're grinding. I see some chat rats in the chat. That's what I like. I like when I got that chat rat in that chat. How's the audio? We're doing a bunch of stuff. Oh, the audio is good. Damn, that audio would be banging. That audio is banging. And we're hanging. You know how we do it? That's nice. These microphones are good. They really are. Because it's clear, it's not clipping. I should have live streamed yesterday, right? 420 live stream. 421 live stream. And we got a live show. Go to Tiny URL. See that right there? Go there. Buy a ticket for the show tonight. Come and say hey and hang out with a pimp. You can become a pimp yourself. Oh, shoot. Somebody's coming on my side. That's why it's nice. I have, like, a camera that can kind of watch my back. There's a lot of cholos. There's cartel members. There's fentanyl addicts. All kinds of people over here. You never know who you're gonna have to deal with out on the streets. So, word to the wise. You always gotta have your head on a swivel. You know what I mean? See these power, power lines? I love being underneath the power lines. That's where I get some of my energy. I'm charging up. I'm charging up! How you like that? Full of charge. Just like your iPhone, that's how I charge up. I go under the power lines. How many power lines have y'all been under today? Zero. That's why your energy's lacking. All right? You get your mind right. Get under the power lines. So I'm under the dart, too. I get the dart energy. <laughs> Free energy, pimp. Free energy. All right. Yeah, we're in Dallas, Texas, dog. The weather's great. Like I said earlier, I got that Belichick hoodie on. No sleeves. Looking right, feeling tight. Excited about the night. Well, 
I'm doing a live show at the House of Comedy in Plano. But tomorrow we're going to be going live too. So that's why I want to go live today. Tomorrow we're going to go live. I don't know which time, what time yet. We might do that show later, like 10 p.m. Central Time. And uh, may, maybe earlier. I don't know. We're going to play with it. But it's going to be available to Blaze TV subscribers. So make sure to go to blazetv.com slash primetime. Use the promo code primetime99 for a 99 cent monthly membership. Come and say, hey, girl, what's up? Ah. Seriously, sign the hell up. Or else I'm going to freak out. I'm going to freak out. Is that what you want me to do? Free? I didn't think so, okay? But I am going to freak out tonight. Public freakouts. I'm going to be on Reddit. Alex Stein, public freakout. Ah! Damn. We got over 300 just on the Primetime channel. I love that. I love that. And we got 100 basically on the other channel. I love that. Oh, I see my girl Melanie Moran in the chat. She's one of the OG mods. We love you, Melanie. You got to send me the link to Marin County, but they messed it up now because of me, kind of, in a way. The Zoom calls. I need to go there and speak in person. But, uh, yeah, we've given them the business a lot in Marin County. Oh, San Fran, Cisco. I'll be at Sacramento State, Melanie. So April 30th. I don't know if you want to drive up there, but I'll be live at Sacramento State speaking at 6 p.m. Uh, Pacific. And I'll be going live on my show, 4 p.m. Pacific. So, Melanie, I see you're in the chat. Come say hey. Come say hey. All right, we're huffing and puffing. We're grinding. We're getting closer to the car. We'll see how long we can go live for. Woo! Woo! The sun feels good. You guys like the live stream? Let me get some love or some some ones in the chat. If you guys like this, if we need to go live more like this. I know we're not. $2 super chat. When are you going to sub submit DNA to Cali for reparation money soon? Actually, I don't want to give them my DNA, even though I'm sure they already have it. I'm sure they already have it. Oh, you got some ones in the chat. You guys like this. You guys like the impromptu live stream fitness life. Well, I got to start adding a lot more miles to my fitness routine. All right. Because I'm just slacking. So maybe I can do these. You guys can hold me accountable. I'll just make them private after the fact and put them on the blaze paywall. You know, we got to. Gotta freaking build this audience up. I do need to go live more. I wanna create even more of a community feel with the content. Because when people leave the community, they miss it. Trust me, they do. So that's why we wanna make it a place where like, people are having fun, people are enjoying it. And when we go live more, there's more chat, there's more interaction. We get to read the super chats. Thank you for all the super chats, Morgan. Have I missed any super chats? Um, let me look. Let me know, Morgan. You got to be on it if I do. A lot of ones in the chat. That's good. And we're trending in the right direction. All right. I think I got the one at the beginning. I think, but just I always try to. Remind me. I know I've missed some of Ronnie's super chats in the past, and I feel bad. And uh, it's because I had to look at the, the chat to see it. I, I'm sending it to Restream. I'm not sending it through YouTube, so it doesn't aggregate what I'm looking at on what I'm looking at. So it is what it is. But it's starting to get a little stanky. All that rain mixing with all this mud. But looks like they cut the grass here recently. See, that's Southwest Airlines headquarters right there. See that? See that, Pam? 
Oh, ten dollars super chat from Robbie. Thank you. The rat in the chat will be in Sacramento to party with a pimp. Awesome, Robbie. We can't wait to hang out. Thank you, Robbie, for the ten bucks. Yeah, can't wait to see all y'all in Sacramento. I hope I see some of y'all tonight in play now. We're gonna be going through the hits. Then I got uh we got over 300 people on YouTube right now. That's awesome. That's awesome. Thank you guys. And then Morgan's putting the freaking link in there. All right, well, you know, Boeing, they're freaking out because they sold Southwest a bunch of those planes, those, those Max planes. And one of them was Southwest, but it was high enough that like the plane automatically nosedived because of a software issue. And they supposedly fix that, but they're still in Southwest fleet. And I fly Southwest all the time because they have good deals because I'm at their like main hub. So kind of scary that the new planes are having more issues than the old ones did. And that's how it is for used cars. I know a lot about used cars. Like as soon as they started adding more sensors and more computers to a car, there's just more stuff to break, to go wrong. You know, like when it's, it comes to a plane or a car, you would think you want like some redundancy to like protect stuff. Like if something goes wrong, you do want a lot of sensors and stuff, right? That would make sense in a plane, you want lots of sensors, but and for every sensor, that's more computer, more hardware, and more possibility for it to like mess up. So it's kind of like a catch 22. This is the people rowing right here. Everybody, Mark Zuckerberg used to train at Bachman Lake. He's, this is one of his favorite places to train. These kids don't know they're walking on, they're, they're rowing on a great, great place. Mark Zuckerberg would just spend hours here. A lot of Latino rowers, all kinds of people, every walk of life. So they don't even know the greatness of the lake, of that water. Zuckerberg trained for nationals. So did the Winklevoss twins. And that's why he created Facebook. It's because the Winklevosses were on the Harvard row team. And Zuck just didn't have enough for college rowing. And so it kind of made it his personal vendetta to screw the Winklevosses over. So a lot of, a lot of good rowers have come up through Bachman Lake. Never forget that. For all the rowers in the chat. See that? $50 super chat. Save the turtles. David Ams. Wow. Thank you. 50 bucks. High roll up, Ken. High rolling. $50. Makes you want to holler. That's what I like to see. Money in the bank. Shorty, what you drank. We popping bottles tonight. Thank you for the $50 super chat. $50 super chat. And we're still live. Oh my gosh, is it timed out? $5 from Craig Road Jr. Why don't you do a show in Macau? Wait, did it just time out? Did you not see any of my super chat celebration? You're kidding. We got a $50 super chat. $50 from David Ann. And then followed. Buy a freaking five dollar by Craig Road Jr. But that fifty dollar, it just hit. It hit so good. So thank you for that. Scott Starboard is a king. He'll be there. He's a top chat rat. We're hustling, y'all. We hustling. We really out here trying to make a difference. Trying to burn a calorie. Can't you see? When I be on TV, trying to look more beauty tea. Beautiful. How you fool? All right, we're on the grind all the time. Do not feed the dogs, but I still feed them, bitches. I still feed them filet mignon. That's what I give them for gua. Oh wait, that's not. That's not good. That's not good. Ah! Ah! You see my tongue? Hey, I'm dehydrated. Ah! You know, when you're hustling and you're bustling, this is what you do, dog. 
We got 315, feeling lean already. I'm already losing weight. I'm a fitness queen. Nobody will be as thin as me. I'll be the thinnest guy on all of YouTube soon. Y'all gonna be like, damn, he's thin. I'll be like, yep, yep. Yes, I is. Woo, woo. I don't know, can you hear me? Is the audio so windy? I don't know how bad the audio is. But we're hustling and bustling. We're putting in the work. Yeah, one day at a time, dog, just like fitting all sobriety. One day at a time for all my fitting all freaks. Woo. Audio is good. Thank you, Morgan. Sounds okay. Henry says okay. Morgan says good. I'm going to believe Morgan, the top chat rat. Always believe Morgan, the top chat rat. All right? Damn. Some of y'all got it twisted. Y'all are smoking some mid. Y'all smoking that mid gray. Y'all need to freaking raise that up, pimp. Yeah. Mm hmm. Y'all need that hydroponic bubonic. Ah, no, no, that mid gray Reggie Miller. 300. 300 in the chat. Let's go. We're going to be going live all the time with Primetime 99. We're going to be yelling and screaming like we're really beaming any given Sunday. Let him play a play play every single day. day. All right. Gosh, I just lose my mind sometimes. Y'all don't ever want to respect the pimp. Y'all never try to respect the PM. Let's see if I can. I hope it doesn't get knocked over. I feel like it might. Yo, yo, it's the pimp. It's a pimp on a blend. Always eating shrimp. Exercise, exercise. Feeling good. High knees, high knees, high knees. This is how you do fitness. So you do you kick, kick, you stretch. Ooh, ah. Ooh, I feel good in the hood. What's the chat saying? What's the chat saying? What is the chat saying? I'm not live. I'm a little late. All right, now I'm live. What are you guys saying? Looks like y'all are mad. Looks like y'all are mad right now. Don't be mad. Don't be mad. We're grinding. Okay? Doing a little fitness. Well, I'm a fitness freak. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fitness freak. Woo. That's how we work out, folks. You're not going to get this from your normal influencer. These are real practical exercises for people of all weights. You can be 500 pounds and follow my workout routine. It's actually for morbidly obese people. If you're morbidly obese and you want to get lean, even you can do these workouts. We're going to do the roly poly. Uh, uh, let's see. We got, we got all kinds of workouts. This is one of my favorite workouts. Just do the roll. Ugh. Just roll. Just rolling. This works your whole body. Rolling like this. You just roll. I just roll all day. Rolling poly vibes. Just roll all day. Oh, I'm, I'm dizzy. You don't want to roll too much. All right. You roll like that. You roll like that. Even a 700 pound person can roll like that. And you'll get lean. You'll get ripped. Okay? So yes, if you guys wanna lose weight, start rolling. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. All right, look at this. 
Y'all ain't never seen a fanny pack before. Y'all ain't never seen a fanny pack before. Got that fanny pack, yo. Got that fanny pack, yo. Got that crack in my fanny pack. Crack in my fanny pack. Crack in my fanny pack. And you know I got that crack in my fanny pack. 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 Woo! That guy was, he was, he thought I was a little twisted. That wasn't nice. Paige, I see you're in the chat. Did you eat anything? Do I need to pick us up Chipotle or something? This is how we do it, guys. He was not feeling it. A lot of people don't love the camera. I don't blame them. We are putting in the work today. Putting in the work hard. I see Paige in the chat. Where should we go pick up food? I, oh, you didn't eat? You're waiting for me. Well, we can freaking go. We can go to Chipotle. Oh, man, we're on the grind. Oh, hustling and bustling. It's just... Looks like they're, they're looking, they're mean mugging. They're mean mugging. He looked like he was mad about something. I'm not even kidding. He was like, oh, blah, 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 blah. So didn't want to interrupt him. Okay. Well, guys, this is a whole lot. We're back where we started. We don't have to end the stream yet. Oh, crap. It's three. You know what that means? We got to get ready for the show tonight. I'll let you guys come get food. If I see if pay-per-view, she's in the chat. I don't know where she wants me to get food. Where are you at, pay-per-view? Pay Make sure to get tickets. You guys see the scroller, the thing scrolling at the bottom? Come on. Come on. I know Chipotle's gross. It's just by here. I mean, what's somewhere easy we can go to? Maybe we can go to... Text me or G. I mean, I don't know if I want Jimmy John's, but I guess I'll eat Jimmy John's. Paige, I guess text me Jimmy John's maybe. I don't know. I can get a sandwich. I can get that veggie sandwich. Veggie sandwich. I mean, I don't know if I really want that either. I don't want Chipotle. I don't know why I said that. It's just easy and it's like right by where we're at. It's actually gross. <sighs> Let's see if I can. All right. All right. Let's see. We got 300 people in the chat still. All right. All right. Taco Bell. Oh, $10 super chat, Benjamin Hamilton. Say hello to your favorite Latina booty. I love that. I don't know where we should go. I don't know where we should go. I don't know where we should go. Crap, maybe I can put it. I don't want it to, I don't want it to turn off. Ooh. Okay, crap. It's giving me only 20 percent less. We got a bunch of clothes in the car. We got the pimp shirt. We got a keyboard. This is not how we do it. Okay. All right. $10 super chat. Firehouse subs. No, I don't know if we should go to Taco Bell. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Free, let's call her. Oh my gosh. This is insane. I don't know what we should eat. Laying in bed. Okay, well, this is, we're live on the internet right now, so be careful with what you say. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh, this is difficult. You're making this difficult for me. I mean... What did I, I said Chipotle sounded good. Maybe Taco Bell. What do you get from Taco Bell? Just the three taco meal? I don't, yeah, I'll text you what I get. I wouldn't eat Taco Bell. I mean, it's just maybe easy to get. Um, all right. I guess we'll just get Taco Bell because that's the healthiest thing they make. You know? Okay, I'll text you. All right, bye. Okay, thank you. You're welcome, bye. bye. Okay, guys, this is how we eat healthy. We exercise and we eat bean burritos. Exercise and eat bean burritos. You guys know how we do it? Uh, y'all want that grilled cheese steak burrito? I doubt that. We're not doing all that. We're not doing all that, you know? How do you guys like the stream? Should we do this again? Let's put ones in the chat if you guys are liking the stream. If you guys want to go to Taco Bell, we might end the stream. I don't know if you guys get to go to Taco Bell. I mean, I'm, I would kind of want to because David gave a $50 super chat, so I feel like I owe it to y'all. Um, I definitely owe it to David for y'all to see what it's like when I go to 7-Eleven. 7-Eleven. There's ones in the chat. That's what I like. We're not distracted, dog. I got my eyes on the road. I'm like Jeff Gordon, man. Y'all are hating. Come on. This is how we do it. You know, some of y'all don't even drive like this. Y'all aren't on the streets like this, grinding, hustling. There's an ambulance. That's not good. That's not good at all. Looks like we still got the mics going. We only got 20% left on the, uh, the phone battery, but that should be enough. Look at the, oh, $20 super chat. Benjamin Hamilton, demand a root beer. Thank you. Is that 30 bucks from Benjamin Hamilton coming in strong today? Yeah, that's what I love. Somebody's having homemade tacos. Man, I got a Taco Bell because they know me in there. They treat me like royalty at that Taco Bell. Actually, the one we're going to, they don't like me that much in that one. But there's another one where they do treat me like royalty. <laughs> we're hustling and bustling. Who's going to be in Plano tonight? Let me see some ones in the chat if you're going to be in Plano tonight. Let's see some ones in the chat. We got to represent, y'all. We love you, Brooklyn Sharp. We love you back. Bebop, we love you, Bebop. Love you. All right? Damn. Let's see if I can do this a little. Let's go to... Let's see if we can get it going like this. Let's see. Prime time. And I grind and shine. Driving down the road. Just pushing the load. Take it to the track. Then I do some crap. I don't care if you want a black. Gonna play some black jack. 21 Ace and King. That's why I like to sing. Got to win the championship ring. Put it on my finger. Please don't linger. Do it really quick. Make me really sick. Cause I am a first round draft pick. Every single day, I'm driving down the road. Every single day, I'm carrying the load.
cheesy bit of rice. What you gonna do? Cheesy bit of rice. What you gonna do? Get that in the tortilla. I hope you can feel your face. You are in disgrace. Taco Bell is my favorite place. And I love the taste. I don't care about your race. Make that. It's a lot of pop. Don't call the cop. Please don't stop. I want some more Tesla. Battery isn't good. As a factory of a gas car, you can go far. And you don't need a charge station. I don't care if you're a Haitian. Always got to drive the full runner. I am a gunner. Hey, I'm your mother and your brother and your sister. Gonna pop you like a blister. 90 rap was the best. Prime time always passes the test. You know I'm going to Taco Bell. And you know what they about to sell. Two cheesy bean and rice is in the bag. And you know my pants will sag when I drive through. What you gonna do? And you know I'm ordering the number two. Cheese and meat on the taco. I'm a pimp. Now you know. Make the left to the stop. I don't care if you a cop. I got to go get my dinner. Pimp, I am a winner. Taco Bell, ho. Taco Bell slow. Taco Bell all night. Taco Bell if you're black or white. Taco, Taco Bell, Taco, Taco Bell, Taco, Taco. We at Taco Bell. That's how we do it, guys. That's how we do it. Y'all don't know what it's like to eat at Taco Bell. Eat at Taco Bell. Eat at Taco Bell, yo. If we stand on the highway. Trying to see the live stream. Eat at Taco Bell, yo. (laughs) Okay, I got to. All right, let's see. Trying to see the live stream. All right, now you're hearing an echo. Yes, Matt, please get a number one with just meat and cheese only. Regular and crunchy with a Mountain Dew. And then two cheesy bean and rice burritos. You said meat and cheese only? Yeah, meat and cheese only on that. Okay. And then two cheesy bean and rice burritos, please. And then two orders of the chips and cheese. Okay. And then can I get a side of the uh, the chip or the uh, spicy ranch sauce? Okay. That's it. Yep. Would you like No. Okay, so Thank you. Dog, uh, we a Pam. That's how we do it at Taco Bell. Taco Bell, yo. Taco Bell. All right, we got we got the order. What are you guys saying in the chat? I know y'all are talking crap in the chat. I don't know. Could you even hear the freestyle? I don't even know if you could hear it. All the sprinklers are getting us in a way. Okay. 312 people. We love it. All the sprinklers are getting us in a way. Okay. 312 people. We love it. You're hearing the echo. You're hearing the echo like a mother trucker. Let me chug this water. Got this Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew all day and day. You know, that's the right color. Thank you. You got that Mountain Dew. 
delicious Mountain Dew. What you gonna do? What you gonna do with that Mountain Dew? Code Red came out right before 9-11. And we started getting a bunch of codes on terror. Dog, I drink seven Mountain Dews a day. It's healthy. They just said as long as not, thank you. As long as I don't drink a twelve pack, that's what they said. So now we go in down the road and we got Taco Bell. Taco Bell, what you gonna do? Gonna eat Taco Bell? All right. Um, oh shit. Oh shit, traffic, 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 traffic on my mind, traffic on my mind, traffic on my mind. Gonna take this U turn, gonna make you freaks learn. I don't really like that. Bro. Oh, what's this all about? Oh, oh, oh! Bye, bye. Driving down the road. And you know I can't read the law. Gonna be a tragic affair. Gonna pull you in your underwear. Where's the attack from the back? I don't care if you're white or black. Driving down the road. Bad time, pushing the law. In Dallas, Texas. The streets are paved real bad. I'm a pimp. And I made you glad. I'm just taking left, turning in front of me. Turn a G, driving on Hennessy. Drunk driving all day long. Drunk driving, call your mom. 911, we're having fun. Driving down the road with a loaded gun. Doing this all night long. I'm so sorry to call your mom. Got the money, we go to jail. And you know we're gonna say hell. That was. Super wild. Don't treat me like a stepchild because I'm going fast in the middle lane. And you know that's when I cause the most pain because I can't go left and right. You know I speed all day and night. And I'm driving super fast. And I'm also teaching class. My foot's all up on the gas because you know I got to slow pass all of them big old trucks. Make it say, holy fuck, oh, don't want to cuss on the stream. You know I got ice cream, Taco Bell burrito. Get a goddamn nacho. Nacho. Uh-huh. Nacho. Nacho. Yo, I got the ranch and I do a little thing. Yo, I got the ranch and I do a little thing. Yo, I got the ranch and I do a little thing. Ranch and I do a little thing. Yes, I got the ranch and I do a little now. Get that burrito. Gotta get the burrito. Don't you know? This is a burrito. This is a burrito. Burrito. Don't you know? And you know I'm driving slow. Damn, that's a good burrito. It's a hell of a burrito. Chips. Cheesy bean and rice. Damn you are so nice. Really freaking warm. Tortilla corn. And I love the way you taste. It don't matter about your race. President 
and you know he's relevant. Cause God died to put that man in jail. It don't matter because he will make bail. All help Donald Trump. He will throw the country in a trunk and fix us. Drive it to the border, create law and order. <laughs> She she being in rice. She she being in rice. She she being in rice. Yo, I am too nice with that cheesy being in rice. Cause you know I'm too nice with that cheesy being in rice. Cause you know I'm too nice with that cheesy being in rice. Cause you know I'm too nice with that cheesy being in rice. Cause you know I'm too nice. Cause you know I'm too nice. Last bye for all you bitches. Oh. <laughs> Soda. That was very gross. No, I wasn't Yoda. Because I would have known. That coat didn't hit the zone. All right. That was insane. That, that warm soda was not the best. Okay. All right. All right, folks. Well, what did we learn today? We learned a whole heck of a lot. What they're trying to Oh, crap. We learned a whole heck of a lot. We learned that I got to get on the grind. It's 3.30. I got a lot of planning I need to do in the next two hours for the show tonight. Um, it's going to be a blast. If you guys are in Plano, make sure to get tickets. tinyurlcom slash 99 in Plano. Uh, let's see what the chat, what's the chat saying? You guys like the freestyle and having fun in the car? I hope. We'll be doing this more. We got to go live more. Um you going to see all that soda? Ooh, that's delicious. Okay. Well, we were just freaking... Uh... No, I'm burping. I ate that burrito so fast. You guys know what happens when you talk about really fast. You got to go to the bathroom. Ah! Sad but true reality. All right. And that's kind of a analogy for, li- for life, you know? Life can be tragic. All right, pimps. I love you guys. This has been a fun stream. We're going to do some more of these. Uh, I hope I see some of y'all in Plano tonight. Like I said, be on the lookout. We're going to be doing more live stream Monday. Tomorrow, we'll be going live for an hour or two. Maybe doing call-ins tomorrow. I don't know. We will start doing call-in shows. Um, But, no, I'm at home. I love you guys. We're going to end the stream. Peace. Yo, did I get all the Super Chats? Yes, we got all the Super Chats. I love you guys. Peace.